Oh. I'm not saying it. Bro. The Yeezy, the Yeezy 350, bro. What's up guys, welcome back to another video on the channel Legit Vlogs, my name is Tim and if you're not already part of the Legit Nation, what are you doing? Hit that subscribe button guys, today we are going to the mall, we are out here on vacation with my boy JP behind the camera, shout out to my boy, we got my boy Big John back there in the back, and then we got Beth getting ready in the room because you know that's what girls do, they just take forever getting ready. Anyways guys, right now we're at the mall because we're going to shoot a little episode for you guys, Ross versus the mall. Now. A lot of people like to call me the Ross Boss. Not self-appointed, by the way. I'm not just going to call myself a Ross Boss. You guys always say it. Tim, you're the Ross Boss. So as the Ross Boss, I have to evaluate and eliminate different stores and see, is Ross really supreme? Is Ross really supreme above every other store? And why is it supreme? So today, we're going to be comparing the shoes at the mall versus shoes at Ross and see if you're really getting the bang for your buck or if you should just be saving up and going to the mall. So let's truly figure out what is a better option. Let's hit up the mall. So you're in middle school, you're in high school, your first initial reaction might be, hey, I wanna go to the mall, I wanna get fresh, I wanna go to Foot Locker, grab some kicks, but right now we're gonna go to Foot Locker and we're gonna see the prices, we're gonna see the variety of the type of shoes that they got, and uh, we're just gonna see, is it worth it really to go to Foot Locker or are you better off just going to Ross with your mom? Oh man, it looks like they got a lot of variety of Adidas, man. I remember, dude, these, these just came just out, bro. Dropped. These are popping, bro. These are hot. If you didn't get a chance to get the Triple Black Ultra Boost, I got them. They're amazing, but this shoe looks like a good alternative if you didn't get to pick them up. And the price, the, there's not a price on here, but this is a really dope sneaker, honestly. I don't think you're gonna find something like this in a Ross. Now, it's very rare that you're gonna find an Ultra Boost in the Ross. Yes, there are people that have found Ultra Boost in the Ross. Very rare, though. That's the thing. So, that's something you're not gonna get in Ross is like Ultra Boost or heat like that. You might not always find at the Ross, but it is possible. It is possible because one of my friends, Glenn, did find Ultra Boost in the Ross. Um, but you got shoes like this, the NMDs, which are like a cheaper alternative. I think these are like 120. But then you got the cheapest sneakers over here, which are like $60, $69. And I wonder if like this would be cheaper at Ross or here, $60. See, most of the time, guys, what they do is if Foot Locker can't sell a lot of their sneakers, what they'll do is they'll sell them to Ross. And I, I know this because sometimes like the Foot Locker sticker will still be there once it's in the Ross. And so it, once they can't sell them Foot Locker, they go to Ross. So are you better off going to Foot Locker or Ross? I don't know yet because there's a lot more inventory here than you're gonna find in Ross. Like you're not gonna find these in Ross. These just dropped. So if you want something like this, you're definitely not gonna find it in Ross. But if you want the cheapest of the cheap, you're probably better off going to Ross. I mean, got some Pharrells in here. These are on sale for $69. So not bad, not bad of a price. But I wonder if we're gonna find better, cheaper sneakers in Ross. All right, so they got a lot of Air Jordans in here. For sure, you're not gonna be finding something like this at the Ross. Dang, now, this is an Air Jordan. Bro, this is an Air Jordan that just dropped, and you're definitely not gonna find some Air Jordans in Ross. Once in a while, bro, like once in a blue moon, once in like a miracle, you might find something like this. But something like this, you can only get at Foot Locker. So something like this, it would be better just to save up your money, you know what I'm saying? Don't like, don't spend it on a bunch of stuff. Save up your money for a sneaker that you really, really want. Then you could come to Foot Locker and grab some major heat. But you can also find some real steals at Ross too. These tens are dope. I never picked them up. What do you think of these, bro? Mm. They're all right. I like those, but I don't know if I'd cop them. I, I like. I, I like, copped the nines. That's why I didn't cop these. I the like nines these elevens better, honestly. Yeah, the elevens are. I feel like if the you don't like you the don't green like color, the green, John. I feel like if this was black, it would be way better, honestly. But I love Concord. Concord. But that's my favorite. That's my favorite sneaker, so I'm gonna be biased, of course. But um. <clears throat> Let me see what, what what which one of these sneakers can you find in Ross? You can find this in Ross for sure. Oh yeah, something for like sure. this. Those we are always at Ross. But dude, like, there's no tags on any of these sneakers. Um, but anyways, something like this you could definitely find for cheaper. I wonder at Ross. what the price difference is gonna be from here in Ross. 
yeah i don't know let me i might have to ask the employee because i don't know how much those are but um yeah man i mean i think you can find some pretty Jordans. much like all those i feel like you yeah, can like possibly all have. these you can possibly find in ross but you're definitely not gonna find the retros in ross because those are super super like not super super rare but everybody likes those more than those yeah. like basically. those westbrooks we yeah. always see those. like the westbrooks we always see these in ross like if you want some westbrooks these are 100 bucks you probably get these at ross for like half i don't know price. like half the price yeah i would say like 50 bucks so not bad all right so we found these jordan futures for 150. i found the price tag on there and there it says 150. you probably can't see it but um we're gonna find the exact same shoe at ross and then i'm gonna let you guys know what the price difference is but let's look around just a little bit more at this ross at this mall and see if we can find some stuff that you can't find at ross lebron james now something like this it's new it's fresh everybody wants it you're most likely not gonna find this at ross a sneaker like this if you want it you're gonna have to save up for it but something like this you know a a lebron that nobody really you know is super messing with something like this you could probably find at a ross i found plenty of lebrons before at the ross like a lebron like this you could definitely find at the ross it's 130 here at the ross it'd probably be like i don't know like 50 bucks so i mean there's a big difference between like ross and um between ross and and uh the mall but like something like this, I feel like you could find as well. Um, I know I've seen these in the Nike outlet. That's another video we could do. If this video hits 3,000 thumbs up, thumbs up the video, we will do the mall versus Nike outlet. So let us know if you want that video as well. Um, I know I try to keep it really entertaining on this channel, but you know, it doesn't hurt to throw in like a cool like uh, shopping video for y'all guys once in a while, cause I know y'all love that too. So let me know down below. Um, what is your favorite sneaker to get at Ross? Let me know. But anyways, let's keep going. These Nike Dunks, I always see these at Ross right here. And right here, they're $100. At Ross, they'll probably be somewhere between like $50 and $70. So you're going to get a big chunk off. You don't necessarily need to buy something like this at Foot Locker. But like I said, guys, it just goes back to it. If you want that heat, if you want that fire, if you want that super hot, fresh shoe that nobody has, you're going to have to come pick it up at the mall. But if you want, you know, if you're just looking if for you're some just sneakers. Looking for that pair of kicks. If you're you know, just looking wear, for that pair of kicks, yeah. Or, or the ball in. even if you're looking for a pair to ball in, I feel like it would be smarter to buy at the Ross. Something that you don't necessarily want to like stunt in, but something that you just want to like rock for fun. Because like a lot of these sneakers. Whoa. I'm not saying it. Bro, the Yeezy, the Yeezy 350, bro. The Yeezy Pirate Black 350. Oh, I bro, seen these in a this minute. is something that I would have never oh thought I would have seen gosh, in the Foot Locker. It's a miracle. Bro, we have to cop right now. Hey, no, we have but to cop. There's nothing like Yeezys. There's nothing like, like <laughs> dang, low key, just in Casey Neistat's <laughs> interview, <laughs> though. <laughs> he's, he's knocking on Casey because in Casey's interview, he was holding up the Yeezy 350 and said, See, this is a shoe that nobody has ever thought of before. It's really original. But, but yeah, like they've come out with the Roshi run. So, I mean, we love Casey, but like, come on, bro. Roshi runs. All right, guys. So we just checked out Foot Locker. It was okay. What'd you think of Foot Locker? Pretty dope. All right. It was all right. I mean, it was all right. It was pretty dope. But now we're going to check out the Ross kicks because I have a feeling that we're going to find some really good kicks in the Ross that can save you a lot of money. So let's go check it out. And the Ross boss is back, baby. We are here to conquer. We're here to look for the deals. We're here to look for the deals out here in the coast. Feeling good, feeling great. Let's go see what's inside and what we can find for the deals today. Oh my gosh, bro, those walls have so many shoes. Check it out, bro. Look at how many shoes they have in this wall. Bro. Dude, that is insane, bro. They are stuffed with shoes. The main difference between Ross and the mall is that at the mall, you go in, you know what they have, you buy it. At Ross, it's a hunt. So we're about to begin this hunt. All right, so starting off, there's already a lot of shoes that I've seen in Foot Locker before. These are only $40, and uh, they even have the Foot Locker sticker inside. See how it says eight in there? I believe that's from Foot Locker. So that's how you know that these shoes are coming straight out of Foot Locker. In Foot Locker, these would have been like more than $100. Here, they're only $40. We got some of these LeBrons. Exactly what I told you guys in the last clip. You can find LeBrons in here. Of course, they're not going to be the hottest LeBrons. But these are only $31. $31.38. Oh, Freaking cheap, bro. Super, super cheap. So in, in the mall, these would have been like $100 and something. $31 here. You could buy like three, maybe even four pairs of these for what you would pay at the mall, bro. Freaking cheap. I'm telling you guys top steals here in Ross. We got some some Nike, we got some Jordans here, and these are going to be what'd you find, John? Curry. 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 I like that colorway. 55. 55. Yeah, that matches your outfit. Hey, so these are $50 in the mall. They would have been at least $100. That's half off, bro. That's steals and deals all day. 
we not only that but we also got the nike sbs so if you're a skater you don't only have to be a sneakerhead you could be a skater and come get your steals 32 dollars bro 32 dude, dude you get like insane. five pairs for this pair that you, for the price you pay for one boom steal we got some more jordans in here like we told you guys you can find jordans in here bro, now, i not, swear dude, I sold them for these were in full locker bro and these are only 55 dollars now it says comparable value to 120 bro you can get two pairs of these for the price of one so you'd rather come to ross get something not as hot but get more sneakers for your sneaker collection or you could go to Foot Locker and get one hot sneaker for your sneaker collection it honestly just depends on the type of sneaker head you are or the type of collector you are see me being older i'd rather have more heat um than more sneakers but if you're young and you want more sneakers come to ross it's a good way to build up your sneaker collection these right here boom these were in Foot Locker for 120 40 dollars here deals and deals. three for the price of one 40 dollars or 120 for one you decide which one you want bro because honestly it's deals right here like we told you guys jordan futures bro, jordan are. horizons right here in the ross 60 dollars comparable value 130 boom clickbait two for the price of one clickbait 13s two for the price of one baby it's a no-brainer bro it's literally a no-brainer if you're buying your shoes and they're not like super hot at the mall you need to stop you need to come to ross because these are 45 dollars boom size 11 at the mall 120 easy 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 so bro if y'all want to save money we got some more of those jordans like i said if y'all want to save money y'all gotta come through to the ross bro but let's search a little bit more and see what else they got Switching it over to my boy okay, JP, his favorite Hold basketball up. player. They got the Penny Hardaways. Y'all already know this. Hardaway back in the day with uh, Orlando Magic colorway. He okay. was a beast. And dude, these are actually on clearance. They say forty nine dollars. Mm -hmm. No, forty four dollars, guys. Oh so yo, steal, dude, right? that is complete Penny Hardaways. Steal. Everyone wants these. Who doesn't Bro, want Penny Hardaways? Check out those so, right there. You got the Nike like sock darts right here. Fifty five. You know what it is? Sock darts. Boom. I used to think these were pestles, but they're actually sock darts. One twenty easy in the mall. Those would be one twenty easy. Twenty easy. How much are they here? Let's see. Fifty four dollars. Wow, 54 bucks, doesn't Boom, it? Nothing. Boom. We got some more curries up here. More curries. More curries, curries, more right curries with that gum bottom. Boom, with you the can gum eat bottom. Like that gum, like gum. Exactly, you gotta bro. eat it. But anyways, right we got Boom. the solid colorway. Boom, smack these on. You look fresh. Go fuck golf ball up. Dude, got some more Air Jordans right here. More Jordans. And these are going to be a $54. Pretty good price than what oh, you're going to give me. RBX. Bro, RBX. Bro, I do that here. bro. You're not RBX. a sneakerhead unless you got RBX in your collection. If you don't got RBX in your collection, you're not a real sneakerhead. I don't know what these are, but I like them. I like them. I don't know. Those what are kind of weird, bro. Somewhere. I like them. Yeah, those are kind of like weird, actually. Like kind of weird, bro. These are crazy, bro. What the heck? <laughs> Dude, those are wild. These bro. look like Prestos. Those honestly. do look like Prestos. Those are super wild. Like, I got some. What are these? I don't even know what these are. Under Armour. Yo, so we're actually filming the sneakers on my side of the channel. But if y'all want to see the outfits compared to the mall versus Ross, go check out my boy JP's channel because he's going to give y'all guys the rundown on that. Part two. But yo, we got some Jordans in here for $55. These are like Damn, a sock. They almost look like, like a, a Converse. Oh, like a, a Converse, Ones, yeah. Converse, Jordan. Kind of weird. Kind of weird vibe one. But um, you never know what you're going to find. We got the Roshi 2 in here. Roshi 2 is in here for $55. They didn't even have these in, in they didn't even have these in full. They had, they the, had the Roshi Run, the Ones. But they got the Roshi 2s in here, baby. Roshi 2. We got Osiris's bro. Dang, I can see the Big the John day. wearing these, bro. John, John. I can see you wearing the Hell no. Dude, he got mad. Oh. I'm out of here. Wow, he got mad, bro. He got it's all I got. Sorry, sorry, sorry. We got some more Air Jordans in here. These is $55 with this purple colorway. Looking beautiful in here. $55 for Jordans. Dude, so many steals. Some more Ds in here. So many steals. We got some cruises in here. Bam, right here Dude, in this cream colorway. Cool. These are gonna be $50. Honestly, this Ross has so much freaking heat, bro. It's insane to show you guys everything. Like, we got some Kobe's in here. Boom, fire right there. You don't even need to go to Full Locker anymore to buy Kobe's. Like, before you had to go to Full Locker, you had no other choice. Now you can come to Ross and get them for half the price. Steals. Some more Jordans in here for $55. I've never really seen this one. It looks like a low top. Um, some Under Armors in here as we continue to browse the shelves. Even if you're into Sperry's, you don't even have to be into sneakers. They got some Sperry's covered. I see my boy Big John rocking out the Sperry's right now. All of a sudden. Boom. All so of instead of Big John wasting his money at the mall, he could have came to Ross and got the steals. Exactly. It's all good next time, bro. Next time. Bro, next time. He's still mad again. He stays mad. Okay, and right here, the Westbrooks. So we already told you guys about the Westbrooks. $60 here in the mall. It was like $120. Literally, literally, you're taking the price and you're cutting it in half, boy. You guys, you don't have to be super rich to have a sneaker collection. I know you see all these other YouTubers that are showing you. You got to spin this at Flight Club. You got to buy this. You got to buy that. But, bro, you can save your money at Ross and be a smart sneakerhead. Some Nike Air Zoom Performance Basketball Shoes for $40. Bam, that is cheaper than you would have found 
in the freaking Foot Locker. So as you can see guys, like I said, coming to a conclusion, what is better, Foot Locker or Ross? Obviously, if you wanna save the money and you wanna get more sneakers for your buck, then you're gonna wanna come to Ross because the sneakers here are good. They're not terrible, but they're not like super hot. But like I said, if you are looking for that one sneaker that is super hot that nobody else has, the Jordan Drops coming, the Adidas Rare, Adidas Booster coming, you're gonna wanna stick to Foot Locker, save up your money a little more, but it all depends on if you want that hot sneaker collection with banger like five shoes or if you want more of a sneaker collection you can get like 15 pairs for the price that you were going to pay for that high sneaker collection at ross so you pick anyways guys thank you for watching another episode if you enjoyed it make sure you smack up the thumbs up button for next time we will do nike outlet versus mall 3,000 likes also subscribe to this channel if y'all want to see more go follow my boy jp's and also gucci bell giveaway down below we will see you guys in the next one stay tuned for tomorrow's episode peace homies stay blessed we're out of here What's up guys? Thank you so much for watching that episode. If you did enjoy it, make sure you smack up that thumbs up button. And if you're not already part of the Legit Nation, hit that subscribe button. Turn my post notifications on. I'm a 20-year-old kid living in San Antonio, making my dreams become a reality. Join the journey and I'll see you guys tomorrow in the next one.